Jeff Wilkins and I are off to London on the 27th for our last uh, site visit this year to, as we prepare for the uh, London Olympics next year. Came here for two reasons. One, for the Chef Commission's meeting that will bring together all 204 chefs who will be attending uh, the Games next year. And also there's a range of test events that gives us an important opportunity to see how London are tracking around their operational capacity and the readiness of, uh, of venues. We're going to have a Weymouth, we're sailing, have a uh, pre-regatta down there, strong New Zealand uh, sailing contingent, and it'll be helpful for us to see uh, how operationally uh, the London Organising Committee have the sailing uh, underway. Yeah, also keen to uh, look at triathlon, they've got their final uh, selection race uh, in Hyde Park. Uh, give us a chance to have a look at how operationally uh, Organising Committee are going. Uh, but also a challenge for triathlon to test how they'll operate at games time because what all sports want to do a year out is to have a test run of how they'll operate uh, at games time next year. Also the World Junior Rowing Champs are uh, happening at uh, Eaton Dorling, uh, which is again the venue for the games uh, rowing uh, and a chance to see how that operates and in the same way as triathlon to see how rowing will operate at games time to test their theory on what they're going to do at that time. And yeah, it's now uh, only just over a year out and really exciting. Uh, London, uh, from our previous visits, are uh, doing a superb job. London Organising Committee are well on track to deliver a, a fantastic game. And so we're looking forward to getting up there to confirm that and to come back and share with sport uh, what it is that they're doing, where they're at and ensure there are no surprises either for sport or athletes when they arrive in London next year.